round of vo uh, voting today in the House of Representatives as Congress wraps up business before the August recess. The House this afternoon passing legislation that would bar bonus pay at banks that would encourage risk taking. The House also voted to add $2 billion to save the Cash for Clunkers program. Congressman Sander Levin of Michigan joins us on the phone. Congressman, welcome to Bloomberg News. Glad to be with you again. Congressman, uh, let's talk about these uh, two measures here. Uh, first, let's talk about that measure uh, about uh, barring the bonus pay. Why is that important? Well, because there's a feeling here that bonuses have gotten out of hand, that few people have a, a, a stake and a participation in the decision. And therefore, we have to really broaden the base of those who participate in it. I mean, that's what it's all about. It isn't an, an, an effort to say people should not receive bonuses. They shouldn't be rewarded for good work. It's just that there should be uh, something other than kind of a self-serving decision-making process. That's what this is all about. Congressman, the Cash for Clunkers program, uh, we mentioned earlier uh, on the air here on Bloomberg that uh, there has been some concern raised, specifically by Senators Dianne Feinstein and Susan Collins, uh, saying that they wouldn't support legislation that wouldn't meet the goal of advancing better fuel efficiency and greater emissions reductions. Does this measure do that? Yes, it does. It does it uh, by its very words. And we'll have to see uh, what the practice has been. Uh, some of my colleagues mentioned some preliminary information that the people who are buying cars were buying uh, the cars with better emission standards than required, really, by the Act. But look, we're in a national economic uh, challenge here. I was listening to your broadcast earlier, and they were talking about the, um, the problem uh, with... Um, with economic growth, and, and especially with consumer demand. Well, this, this bill directly, directly affects consumer demand, and look what's happened. Uh, there's been such a, an influx of applications that it was impossible to handle them all at once, and it looked like, and it does look like, more money's needed. Right. So, so in, in economic terms, this was one of the important measures. Congressman Sander Levin of Michigan joining us on the phone from his office on Capitol Hill. Congressman, thanks.